Hi everyone, and here's a devotional for Saturday, May 9th, 2020. And before I get to the devotional, um, just um, pray for me tonight, because um, if, Lord willing, um, I'm going to be doing the Facebook, Facebook Live thing at 6 o'clock. I'm kind of going to do like a tribute to Mother's Day or whatever, you know. Um, so I hope y'all can come. Those of you who can't, please pray for me, because I want to do only what God wants me to do. I want to be led by him and not by me, because if I'm led by me, I'll just make a mess. Okay, enough rambling. Let's get to it here. Okay, so we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. For what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. 2 Corinthians 4.18 NIV When all I see are the problems of this life, I do not let myself get discouraged. What I do not see is that God's hand is on me, helping me through every situation. Pleasures of this world and problems that I face are temporary and will soon pass away. However, the things of God, which I cannot see, are eternal. This means that they will last forever. That's probably one of my favorite verses, along with um, this is the day the Lord has made and the joy of the Lord is your strength, um, about what is, you know, not seen you know, focusing our eyes on what is not seen. Because, yeah, the things that are happening right in front of us are temporary. They're going to pass away. And that's, um, it can be a comfort. It can be a, um, a fearful thing. But, yeah, like right now, as I'm sitting here recording this, mostly we're doing really, really well. Except, you know, Jeff's health is not good. So pray for him if you think of it. But, um, but yeah, mostly, for the most part, you know, we're doing well. But, you know, Good and bad things all pass. This too shall pass. Okay. And um, so, Lord, help us to fix our eyes on the things that are not seen, the things that you have planned for us. We don't know what those are, Lord, but you do. And help us to find comfort in that and knowing that whatever is going wrong in our lives, it's going to pass away and it's going to be temporary. In Jesus' name, amen. And may the Lord bless you all and be with you. Till tomorrow.